hello everyone welcome back with another new video today I'm going to teach you something different and interesting as all of you know that the multiplication table is a heart of maths so I'm here to explain you how to do this multiplication correct you know when multiplication tables are correct in you the maths become a just a piece of cake Okay, now you would be wondering why I have drawn two palms on this board. And also I have numbered them. See, 6, 7, 8, 9. Same as the other hand, 6, 7, 8, 9. Using your fingers, we are going to find the answers for all of the, num the questions. Come, let's do one example. 18 to 8. When we are getting the answer for 18 to 8, using our fingers, you can see 8 from this hand and 8 from the other. We join those two and below all the fingers with that, we fold it. So how many fingers we have folded? We have folded 6 fingers. Each finger carries 10. So that means we have folded 60. Now the balance, we have 2 on top and 2 on the other hand also. We have to multiply these two. 2 into 2 will give us 4. So 60 plus 4 will give us 64. Let's see another example. Let's see uh, 9 into 7. When it is 9 into 7, how do we take 9 from first hand and 7 from the other hand and we fold all the fingers with that. So how many fingers have we folded? We have again folded 6 fingers, which means 60. And 1 balance from this hand, 3 balance from the other hand. So 1 multiplied by 3 will give us 3. So 60 plus 3 will give... Hope you all have understood the method that I am following in these multiplication tables. Let's uh, move on another sum and also check to see. Let's see 6 into 8. When we are doing 6 into 8, we take 6 from the first hand, 8 from the other, and we fold. How many fingers we fold? We fold 4 fingers. Once we fold the 4 fingers, what is balance? From top, there's 4 balance and 2. So 4 into 2 will give us 8. So 40 plus 8 will give us 48. How? It's becoming easy, isn't it? As the final, let's check 7 into 8. 7 into 8. 7 into 8 when we are getting. So 7 from one hand, 8 from the other hand will give this way. So then we fold all the fingers below, isn't it? When we are folding, we have folded 5 fingers, which means 50. Very good. So 3 from one hand, 2 from the other hand, which is balance. So 3 into 2 will give us 6. 50 plus 6 will give how much? 56. There you are. So hope all of you have understood the trick of multiplications and maths will definitely be easy for you. Please try this for all the other numbers which is there. Hope you will have a wonderful multiplication table hereafter. 